and I'm um, hoping to just bring anything I possibly can um, and help in any way I can, uh, whether that's sort of on the pitch or even off the pitch with the you know the players that have not been through certain situations before. Um, I've you know seen plenty, so hopefully I can help. You've been on trial for a few weeks now. How did you find that period? Yeah, it was good. It was just um, it, I appreciated the you know the opportunity to come and, and sort of prove myself um, and also get up to speed. So I, I quickly got up to speed with a few games and um, yeah, just started enjoying it. And um, yeah, thankfully it's resulted in you know being rewarded with a contract. came here when I was in our youth team, we played a youth cup game here, so I knew what the stadium was like, what the atmosphere was going to be like, but no, I just, first impression is really good. For supporters that won't have seen you play, yeah. just tell us a little bit about what sort of striker you are. Yeah, well, um, I like to put myself about, do you know what I mean? I like to work hard and obviously like I'm, I feel like I'm a good finisher, I've scored goals, do you know what I mean? That's what I want to do, that's what I've come here for. Obviously, that's why the gap has signed me, so that's what I want to do. What did Frankie Bunn have to say? Have you spoke to him much? Yeah, um, he rang me obviously a couple of weeks ago. He was just seeing what uh, well, that he wanted that he wanted me really, and I said, well, I wanted to come. And then we were just waiting for the green light from Bournemouth really, and he did, obviously him being an ex-striker was one of the main reasons why I. Uh, come. Chris, welcome back to Oldham. How excited are you about the season ahead? Yeah, really excited. Yeah, it's um, a fine now. So yeah, we've had a good preseason. What's it been like coming back here? I guess it always helps when you know a club very well. Yeah, yeah, that was um, that was one of the things for me. Um, big opportunity this for you, do you think? Yeah, yeah, it's a big opportunity for me, and obviously I'm I'm going to take it. I want to obviously come here and score. That's what I've seen. I think I bring it. Bring me here for. But um, yeah, now I'm just excited to get started. Yes, uh, no, no music though today. Seasons. Let's turn our heads and attentions to Frankie Bonn and Oldham Athletic. Uh, plenty of, um, shall we say, newspaper reports in the past couple of weeks, Frankie, but in pre-season as a whole, has it, has it been smoother? You've been happy with what you've seen? Evening, Mike. Yeah, uh, pre-season's been terrific. Uh, we've had some good results and some uh, good performances. Um, we've got a small squad, so everybody's benefited from uh, playing the uh, 90 minutes and uh, things are looking good. How did this one compare to, to others that you've done in the past? Yeah, I think this one, uh, the first uh, two weeks was uh, stronger than uh, I ever had. But uh, you feel uh, r really fit in every game that you played, so uh, I think it's a very good pre-season. There's a new manager in place now with, with Frankie Bunn. What's he been like to work with? I think uh, uh, the way how he like to work, I uh, like so much because he like to go in the front foot to press everywhere and I like to, uh, this is the way how I like to play, so it's a nice uh, way of to play. We're eventually here, um, we've had a good pre-season, uh, certainly uh, some good performances, some good results, uh, the players look fit and uh, raring to go. You mentioned some of the, the results that the sides had in pre-season then, have you been happy with the build-up? Yeah, they've, they've been terrific. You know, again, we, we've tried to implement change. I think everybody's taken it on board. Um, there's a smile around the place again, and, and everyone's working hard towards uh, our, our goal. You know what I mean? So uh, things are looking good. Now that all that preparation's done, and you know, you, you come into the, the last little bit before it all starts, what are your, your expectations and hopes for the season? Well, like every other manager in the league, you know, we want to get out of this league as quickly as possible. Uh, and everyone will say, we'll, we'll, we'll reassess that after 10 games and see how, how we're going. Hopefully we get off to a terrific start. There's a, a lot of uh, optimism around the place. 
and uh, like I said, the, the the players are bright and they're bubbly. So uh, you know that hopefully that will stand us in good stead. It was amazing. It's been a good pre-season under my belt. Um, it was great to be back in the game. I was going to say you've been out for a year. What was it that made you come back? Um, I feel like just the stars aligned. It was just perfect timing for me to come back. I've been really missing the game, and especially the last couple of months. Like I was just saying before, the World Cup and things like that. You make sure you miss it so much. Obviously, I've knew Frankie for so many years and Rhoda. Um And as soon as obviously we spoke and had the goal, it was just. It just like I said, the stars aligned. I think it was just perfect timing. An easy, an easy decision after that. Yeah, very easy, simple, very simple. Mr. Lemsgum, thank you for joining us. Just tell us, how do you feel ahead of the new season? Excited. This is a new season coming on, and uh, we're happy. This is we have a long pre-season, and we're happy. This is we're ready for it. Yeah.